beautiful day in McKinney today. What is up, guys? My name is Mark Santa Maria. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the RC vlog. Golly, people just throw stuff in my garage. Don't even think about what they're throwing in here. All right, today, very special day. A lot of people have been asking. We are unboxing the Max today. We're gonna do more stuff with the Max today, but for this particular video, it's gonna be unboxing the Max. The MT410 is gonna get built really, really soon. Not that car, but I do have plans for, not that Revo. That Revo right there. Really cool plans for that Revo. Y'all are really gonna enjoy with that. And then I am going to, I need to do speed runs with that because that thing is actually pretty freaking fast. It's got a really big pinion on it. I bet you if I throw a 3S, it's doing over 50. So we're gonna do speed runs with that. And then we're also gonna be doing speed runs with the X01 with the new Proline tires. All those videos coming up soon. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell. But let me grab the Max and let's head inside and unbox that thing. Boom. Sorry guys, I have to let the dog in. She wants to be part of the unboxing. Gotta move all my tires away. Gotta put that in the, uh, the old tire. Hey, get out of here. Hold on, I gotta show you something else. Be right back. All right, here. Check this out. I got this email yesterday. This is the email I got yesterday saying that the brand new Max just came out, the green one. We already got it, guys. We already got it. We're gonna unbox this thing. I'm so excited. This thing looks so cool. All right. Cellophane. Interesting fact about this cellophane, if you go into the Traxxas store, I don't know if I said it in that video, but the Traxxas owner does not like the cellophane on the box, and he makes all the kits that are in display, make sure that they're out of the cellophane so they don't shine and glare, but. A little side note. All right, oh man. I need to get some, a knife. All right, back, got a knife. I like doing videos in this room because I hope you can see my head. I think you can see my head. Um, because it's got so much, so, so, the lighting is really well. It's got so much lighting. I don't know if I'm opening this the right way, but Traxxas TQI remote. I think this is a really underrated remote. Very good remote. I like it a lot. I do have the Bluetooth module for it. Not sure if I'm gonna load it in or not, but we do have it nonetheless. Oh, here it is. Ah, manual out. I don't think there's anything on this other side. Oh, look. Okay, nothing on the other side. Just want to make sure. Here it is. So clean. So it's got that body that comes off without body clips. Ooh, wow. All right, check it out, guys. Oh, looks good. So that ESC is gigantic. I thought about trying to fit that in the MT, maybe take an electronics out of this thing, but that's not gonna happen. The servo, also gigantic. Why is the servo so big? Motor looks big. Looks like just a normal A-scale motor, the, uh, that longer can A-scale motor. Comes with a little fan on top. Love the green and the eye shocks. Looks cool. Let's see how this thing works. Man, I'm gonna have to read the manual on this thing. I don't even know how any of this works, guys. The body. There we go. Oh, look at that, I did it with one hand. I've never done that. Check this thing out, guys. It's kind of crazy that I couldn't figure out. <laughs> this is a new platform for me. So if it was a T-Max platform, uh oh, y'all aren't straight again. You didn't tell me. If it was a T-Max platform or a Revo platform, yeah, no problem. But this is a completely new platform. We're gonna figure out how to get this battery bar off eventually. There we go. Easy enough. Little tabs, you scoot it on the inside. Forest battery should go right up in there. I got the forest battery. Nothing crazy, just super excited. Love the wiring, check the wiring out. They put like um, the outer sheathing. So let's see what comes with the car. 
All right, so what comes with the car is the tool. Looks like tool to take the wheel nuts off. Just guessing, it's probably either a seven millimeter or eight millimeter wheel nut. Comes with a couple Allen wrenches. This comes with another battery bar. Not sure, it's like a battery cover. Not sure, but we'll look at the manual and find out. And then all this stuff. Ugh. All right. We're just gonna open this up and find out what it is. I ain't scared, we'll just open it. For proper fitment of the Traxxas 5000 4.8 volt, four cell 25C LiPo battery, which is what I have, make the following minor modifications to the battery compartment of your model. Remove the foam block A. Removing foam block A. I feel weird, like major crotch shot action. Sorry guys, it is what it is, that's what you get. You get what you get on my channel, guys. I ain't editing anything. Sorry. All right, here we go. Here's the 5000. Yeah, it does not fit. They are correct, so we do have to remove this block. You guys can't see what I'm doing, but essentially the 5000 battery does not fit in there. So I'm removing this block. There you go, block removed. So now, here, I'm gonna go ahead and just put it all the way down. All right. Block out, battery will fit now. It looks like, oh, it does close, but it seems like it's too too much space here. So we're gonna go ahead and do the rest. It says to take this battery bar off, or this battery foam off. This piece should fit. There you go, that's it. So now, this goes in here like so. Actually, let's do it this way. Get in here like so. It fits in there, moves, but fits in there. Not sure how I feel about that movement. Already solving problems here. Perfect. There we go. Doesn't move now. Perfect. And it's got a little bit of shock. So I don't remember where I got this piece of foam, but I got this piece of foam from somewhere. And bam. Oh, she looks good. She looks so good. Super excited. So there you have it guys, that is my Max, that's unboxing it. We're gonna drive this thing. I've already modded the battery, little battery compartment for the 4S5000. I don't think I'm gonna use that remote. I'm probably gonna, I have Traxxas remotes everywhere. I'm trying to consolidate them all on one remote. It's gonna be the same remote, just a different remote. Same kind of remote, different remote. I have the Bluetooth module already installed on it, so we'll be able to bind it all up. So we're gonna try that first and uh, get all that situated, and then we're gonna go run this thing. The very first thing I want to do is see how fast it is out of the box. Also, I want to read the manual on the little self-writing thing because I, I didn't even know I could do that. That's pretty cool. So thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, smash that like button, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to my channel, and you guys will see me next time. Later, guys.